Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Back in February 2021, DRDO conducted maiden trial of vertical launch short range surface to air missile VLSR SAM. The test was carried out to demonstrate the vertical launch capability as a part of its maiden launch campaign and a missile intercepted simulated target with pinpoint accuracy. They were tested for minimum and maximum range. On 7th December, DRDO has conducted second test of this missile. VLSR SAM was test fired from the launch pad number 3 of Integrated Test Range ITR at Chandipur in Balasore at 3.08 pm. Again, on 24th June 2022, DRDO and Indian Navy had successfully flight tested VLSR SAM from an Indian naval ship at ITR Chandipur. The significance of this test is that it's for the first time the missile was tested from Indian Navy warship which means its integration with naval vessel is successful. Today, again, that is on 23rd August, DRDO and Navy successfully flight tested VLSR SAM from an Indian Navy ship against a high-speed unmanned aerial target for demonstration of vertical launch capability. The missile was equipped with indigenous radio frequency seeker and intercepted the target with high accuracy. With two back-to-back -back successful tests, we can expect this missile to be soon inducted into service which is planned by 2023. This VLSR-SAM will be integrated with smaller surface vessels of Indian Navy and will replace Barak-1 legacy SAM system. It will also be integrated with multiple Indian naval platforms like Project 28, Class Corvettes, NGMB, and NGC. The missile is meant for neutralizing various aerial threats at close ranges, including sea skimming targets. It can identify, track, engage, and destroy the target with high kill probability. It has a strike range of about 40 kilometers. The VLSR SAM is going to be an advanced air defense system that will provide a single integrated solution for multiple aerial threats from different ranges. Since it's going to be a vertical launch system, it will ensure 360 degree interception. Each vertical launch unit will be able to house eight heavily modified quick reaction SAMs to engage incoming supersonic projectiles. It will provide point and area defense against various aerial threats like fighter jets, aircraft, unmanned aerial vehicles. VSR SAM will be integrated with an active high-end radio frequency seeker which provides better interception of targets with low radar cross-section and high maneuverability. It's going to have a conformal S-band with two-way full duplex data link antenna. The data link is used to simultaneously receive mid-course updates on the target's position and send missile telemetry data to the ship. Having a data link makes the missile more accurate and jam-proof. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.